me tell you, it feels like a Monday. Robbie didn't want to get up out of bed this morning. There was like stress and chaos all morning long. Um, it was just, it, it was a nightmare morning. And it is 8.10 now. I am staring at a disaster area of a house. So my to-do list today is a mile and a half long full of unpleasant trees like laundry and dishes and dusting and vacuuming and cleaning out my fridge. Like, I want to really tackle this house and get everything done today so that I don't have to stress too much throughout the week. I can just sort of pick up and keep it clean. Um, my room is a complete disaster. You cannot even walk in there. I almost feel guilty for yelling at my kids yesterday to clean their room because their room wasn't as bad as my room is right now. So I need to try to tackle that a little bit. So just a boring, boring cleaning kind of housewifey day. Um... So it's probably not going to be the most exciting vlog ever, but you know how that is. Um, we will have an Advent activity today. Typically the Advent activities, though, on school days are not as involved. They're shorter. They're real simple because we don't have very much time in the evenings. Um, Austin does not get home from school until almost 4.30. And then we have to do dinner at 6. And um, he has to get on his flush for... Um, you know, his evening rituals and things, um, by seven. So really we have like an hour and a half from the time he gets home from school until dinner time. Cause then after dinner, we go right into like our bedtime routine. They don't actually go to bed until nine 30, but, um, you know, his flush takes an hour and then he's got to take a shower and get ready for bed and all of that. So we really just have like an hour and a half in there that we can make use of. And, um, part of that hour and a half is spent doing homework so evenings are hectic around here I think the issue with this cat always climbing up into my lap while I'm filming is because for the most part I am up running around all day and I don't spend a whole lot of time sitting um, obviously I'm sitting right now to film this so he's taking advantage of the fact that I'm sitting to um, have some cuddle time because I don't spend a lot of time sitting Unless I'm like working on my computer and then my computer's in my lap. So that is what's up with this kitty. How cute is he? He's such a beautiful cat. Hmm. Anyways, I need to drink some more coffee, work on a few computery things, finish editing yesterday's vlog, uh, check emails and things, and then I need to start tackling this housework. So I will check in with you guys later with a progress report. Okay, so I went through all the trouble of making my husband a lunch this morning, and then he proceeded to leave it here at home. So I am going to run it down to the shop. I don't even know if he's going to be there, but if not, I'll just leave it in the fridge there. Um, and then I'm going to come back home and finish cleaning up. So I have spent most of the morning working on finishing up my monthly kit. Um, this is just two pages of the three that I designed. I'm not really sure yet exactly what I'm going to keep and what I'm going to get rid of, but this is the basic layout. I have no idea if anything is going to fit. I'm about to find out. I'm hoping everything will fit, but, you know, when you're first doing measurements for the first time, sometimes things don't really work out. So we'll see. Um, I'm going to start laying things down and hope for the best. So I'm actually really, really happy with the way that things fit. I did decide to make a few changes. I don't think I'm going to include the little number stickers because honestly, all of the numbers in this planner are black, so they are going to match just about everything. And um, the way that I did the different boxes and things, um, the holiday boxes don't cover up the numbers, so you don't really need the numbers. And I don't think I'm going to include the headers either because I've left a white space here. You can just totally write in whatever you want this section to be. Um, and that's going to make room for the things that I have on the third sheet of stickers. So I'm hoping to be able to make this kit, this monthly kit, just a two-sheet kit because it'll be much more affordable that way. And um, the other thing I think I'm going to change is I think I'm going to have this sticker be this same pattern so that it all kind of incorporates. So I think those are the changes I'm going to make. And uh, then this will be ready to go. I also need to add an additional payday sticker in because there's five weeks in January. So I um, want at least one payday sticker for every week in the month. So, But overall, considering the fact that... Um, 
I only measured once, I think I did pretty good. Everything fits perfectly. Hey guys, so just checking in. It is just after four o'clock now. Uh, Robbie came home from school and immediately went to a friend's house, so I haven't seen much of him. Um, I feel like I've not accomplished hardly anything today. Um, there's Austin now. Hi, baby guy. How was your day? Good. Good. So, as I was saying, I feel like I haven't accomplished anything today. I did do a ton of laundry. It's all folded and ready to be put away. I also, you guys saw, completed the design for my monthly kits for my shop, which is exciting. I'm very, very, very excited about the prospect of offering monthly kits. And I did put it into my Erin Connor and Life Planner and totally plan out January and everything fits perfectly. I'm very, very happy with it. So there's that. Um, what else did I do? Oh, I also planned out my week, which I guess I could show you. I used my retro Christmas kit for this week. I didn't do a plan with me video. Um, but I did do that, but that's pretty much all I managed to get accomplished today. Everything took longer than it should have. Typical Monday, I swear. Mondays, I always make a super long to-do list, and then nothing ever gets done. Um, so, anyways, Austin's home now. He's going to have a snack. We're going to get all this laundry put away. We're, then we're going to read the card to see what... Um, it's not a card anymore. We forgot. It's not a card. The planner. Whatever. <laughs> um, to see what the advent activity is for the day. I have to make dinner. I think I'm just doing some canned beef stew. Super Retro easy. Cool. What? I said retro looks good. Oh, you like this retro Christmas kit? Mm -hmm. Thanks. Um, and then that's pretty much going to do it. It's just been a boring vlog kind of day. But um, I'll check in with you later and we'll show you what Advent is. You excited about Advent tonight? Mm. Alright. Yeah, I really hope it's going to be something fun. Is it big? Is it small? It's a little one. Any guesses? Um... I just, I'm gonna keep guessing painting ornaments or maybe making a gingerbread house. Nope. Oh. Alright. So we'll check in with you later. Say bye, Austin. Bye! We'll talk about super fast. Um, remember I told you guys in a vlog a couple days ago that I needed replacements for my foiled headers? They arrived today and they look okay, so very exciting. And I received a julep box in the mail. This was the first julep box that I have gotten in probably five months. Um, and I basically only got it because I needed this. I was just about out of my nail polish remover. And the julep nail polish remover is my favorite. So I got a refill of that. And I got this gorgeous polish. Look at I don't know if you even know if you can see or how it's coming across on camera. But this is julep's. Christiana and it's gorgeous like purple glittery um, polish for the holidays and then I got one of the it's whipped flip mousses it's matte and it is in the shade at midnight I thought that this looked really really pretty on the computer screen I'm excited to see what this looks like in person um, hopefully it's as beautiful in real life as it was on the screen. Looks gorgeous in the bottle. I'm gonna do a quick swatch of this and I'll show it to you guys, but I love the packaging of the, this product as well. So, so pretty. The Julep Beauty products um, are always packaged absolutely beautifully. And there is a swatch of that. The lighting in here is terrible, so I'm not sure how well you can see it, but it's just this gorgeous, like, berry-toned um, red, almost, that I think is going to be fantastic for the holidays. So I'm super excited about this, and I love the formula of these as well. So that is my little julep box. There's also a candy cane in here. Um, a green apple candy cane. Maybe one of my kids will appreciate that. But yeah, that's exciting. Um, it's been a long time since I got a julep box. And I gotta say, this was a pretty darn good one. Okay, so we are on to Advent Day 5? Five? 5, yeah. Okay. Right, and Lata Tall Santa. We can do that one after dinner. No! You can do it now if you want, or you can wait till after dinner. after dinner. Write a letter to Santa with your Christmas wish list. Yeah. Doing it now. Okay.
Oh, I'm doing some of it now. Okay. Um, do you have paper and envelope and stuff? Everything? Yep. I'll get you some in a second. So, these are all we've done. Decorate for Christmas. Movie night the second day. Book from the lab. Christmas books from the library. Was the th third. Yesterday the fourth. Sand art ornaments. And now, write a letter to Santa. I was expecting real... You are making me feel bad. I love this advent. You do? Yeah. You like writing letters to Santa? Mm-hmm. Okay. Here we okay, go. Okay, so Austin finished his letter to Santa with his list. Now... He wrote his Christmas wish list, and this is everything he could possibly think of that he wanted. He knows he's not going to get all of this, mm -hmm. but he wanted to give Santa lots and lots of ideas. So go ahead and read it, Austin. <laughs> Dear Santa, these are all of the things I want for Christmas. Cosmo, PS4, Xbox One, desk, desk, Legos, video games, for example, Destiny Infinity 3.0, Skylanders, Imaginators, also Spittoons. Skylanders, Toy Story DVDs, Drano Stilton books, Diary of a Minecraft Zombie books, Diary of a Wimpy Kid books, Hot Cocoa Packets, Candy, Peppermint, Summer Sausage, PC, New Case for Tablet, Money, Pudding, Jello, Cookies, and a Hat. Please try to get me as much as possible. I think I've been good this year from Austin. Very nice. Okay, so $10,000 of worth of stuff. Oh. So dinner is done. It's just canned beef stew. Super, super easy. All we had to do was heat it up on the stovetop. I'll admit, it looks a little like dog food, but it is so good. Especially considering I am freezing. I have my heat set to 73. I'm wearing a sweatshirt, sweatpants, two pairs of socks, and I'm still cold. So I'm going to wrap up in a blanket and eat this stew. Finish watching some Plan With Me videos. I'm watching, um... Girl in a Magical World right now. Um, I have a couple of different Plan With Me videos I need to catch up on. And that's kind of how I'm going to spend the evening. I just spoke to Eric and he's not going to be home anytime soon. So um, I'm going to watch this. I'm going to watch Teen Mom OG in a little bit. It's my guilty pleasure. I really don't watch it very often. Um, I'll go like weeks without watching it and then I'll binge watch a bunch just to catch up. I'm not a big fan of Farrah like at all. She kind of ruins a show for me to be honest. Um, but they're doing part two of the finale tonight and I watched part one last week so I'm gonna go ahead and watch it. So that's kind of how I'm gonna spend my evening. Just sort of mindless television and warm It's the narcotic or whatever. Um, and I didn't like going to the doctor because it felt very much like a diet mill. Like they talked to you for four seconds. They're All right, like, guys, oh, okay. well, it's the end of the night now. Kids are getting ready to go to bed, so we're gonna go ahead and call it a vlog. Thanks, guys, so much for watching today. We will definitely see you tomorrow for more Vlogmas fun. Bye. <laughs> Have a nice night, guys. Bye.